thank you to all my fans, everyone who supported me to win this award. I could not even <laughs> Let me talk to my language. Hey guys, we're on our last stop of the day. We're going to Bankers, which is basically this area. It was, it's, not, it's not even that nice, but it gives you like a good view of the city and it um, shows you this, like the sunset. So we're basically going there just before the sunset. Yeah, so that's the goal. We just have to figure out where we're going because we, we've been getting lost a lot today. Did we not walk for like 15 minutes because we didn't send the bus? Either way, we were lost. So that's where we're going and we're going to show you when we get there. So to get to the place that we were going to, we had to go uphill. But we also had this nice, amazing view that we encountered while we were going there. There was a lot of walking, which honestly I hate. But yeah. <sighs> No, but I'm actually not exaggerating. Like, we've been going up and up. Yeah, it's crazy. But okay, we finally arrived. The things we do just for a freaking view, like. This is so crowded. I don't know if you guys can see. Like, there's so many people. I'm gonna show you the other side, and then right now it's still quite bright outside. What time is it? It's like around. Oh, it's literally six. Oh my god, almost seven. We have to wait up until like at least eight or somewhere around nine to see what goes on. So this is what it looked like before the sun set as i said before there was a lot of people and just look at these people like it was so crowded apparently people kind of host parties here and things like that but it's really a nice place if you just want to chill with your friends and you don't want to spend too much money because you really just like you know, can just bring snacks you can just buy some drinks and whatever um you see here the sun is starting to set we can see the whole view of well not the whole view but like kind of almost the whole view of barcelona oh my god <laughs> it's so fast anyways this is the following day we went for bowling with a bunch of friends this is a last minute thing but you know those last minute plans are always fun but um that was my sister she's actually not that bad and um i'm waiting for my turn i'm trying to buy time <laughs> yeah that's me look at that who would have thought who would have thought anyways the next day was a sunday it was actually easter sunday jesus had resurrected um yeah we went to church it was amazing hey guys this is i don't know what day this is um and today we don't know where we're going we're going on a mysterious adventure i'm just going to be walking my sister to some places she doesn't want to walk but i'm the what do you call it what is it called the co the tour guide so she will have to listen to me and get out We're back in La Rambla, the famous street. I'm taking Panashi somewhere. I told her it's a surprise. She's just asking. It's a surprise. We're going to enjoy the views. And that's about it. <laughs> the street is full, just as usual. And um, we're going to the. <clears throat> And breaking there's news. this <laughs> breaking news in La Rambla. <laughs> there's a lot of cute. Hola. There's a lot of like cute little stars in here. Yeah. <laughs> one, two, one, two. I think it is bad or something. Anyways, um. I just want to say thank you to all my fans, everyone who supported me to win this award. I Jet. could not even <laughs> Practicing, practicing, practice makes perfect. Me when I get an award in the future. Oh. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Hi. 
don't even know what this is. For my friends and family for Christmas or for my birthday, I would appreciate if you buy me <laughs> friends and family. <laughs> I want this for my Christmas present or my birthday present. Or any of these. Or a teddy bear. Okay? Mm -hmm. People are crowded here just to see that thing. Can I zoom? I don't know. That thing. It looks scary. I'm not going to record it for long. I don't like it. Ew. We have another one here. I don't know who she is. But she looks... She's... She's... Gay. What is she sitting on? There's not a lot of look at how there's not any people here. And look at how crowded that is. And then we have um that green thing. Ew. Anyways, this is the place I was bringing her. I honestly don't even know what this is. Well, this is the beginning of the place I was bringing you, but there's better. There's what? There's better. <laughs> What's better? But like this is the beginning of the place. Okay. Look, I don't even know what to say. But basically this is where we where we are. This is where we were coming. This is the mysterious adventurous place I was talking about. Um it's the port. I don't know if it's called the Barcelona port actually, I have no idea. But like see there's a lot of people in that thing. And there's also a lot of people in the other thing. I'm sure they're going on like a cruise trip or something. I've actually never been in one. And I no, no, but not here. Alrighty, alrighty, I'm back with the voiceover. So as we were walking towards the port, we ended up finding this, um, I don't know what it's called, like a playing place for kids. And I was like, you know what? You never know who's watching this video. Maybe you have a kid, maybe you have kids, maybe you're going to come with your little siblings or whatever. There is some, a lot of like, I don't know what they're called. I don't know what they're called. But basically this places that like kids can have these rides or whatever so there was actually like a whole thing on this day there was like some loud music there was a lot of different games different rides this is um i don't know who that guy is actually but he low-key looks like panache and there's mini mouse i think there was mini mouse but there was just like a lot of um rides which i thought was very very interesting because like at first, I was just thinking about, like, when adults visit. But I was like, oh, kids are going to visit too. And the interests of kids are different from those of adults. So, yeah, you enjoy this little tour of this place. Guys, look at how big this thing is. I wonder what they have in there. <laughs> that thing is huge. I don't even think the camera is doing it justice. Like it's so big. Wanna this oh this is actually my first time seeing this. There's a bunch of cars. You see that? Who's wanna? Can I Tony, this thing is good. It's cold but it's really good. I just don't know. I don't know, just on you know. 
And for our next adventure, we went to the beach. The weather was not really great when my sister came, so it was really hard to find a good day to go to the beach. But this was um, one of those days where the weather was kind of like okay-ish. So uh, we actually went to a beach called Badalona Beach, which is like kind of further away from Barcelona. The reason why we went there is because it's a little bit less crowded there. It's a little bit more peaceful as you can see like it's just like it's better a lot of people usually go to uh barceloneta beach which is the most famous beach in barcelona but you can just go further down the coastline or whatever you call it and you can get like i don't know it's just like that areas are too crowded but yeah it was really hard to record at the beach because as you guys know in spain there's this whole thing of like people being topless at the beach which I said it was a culture shock for me. So, like, I couldn't really go around and, like, record people because it would have been a lot. Guys, I don't know if you can hear me because it's windy, but we... You remember how we lost a bandana like a few days ago? Today we lost a hat. We were just sitting at the beach and then it just disappeared. And we looked everywhere, we couldn't find it. We gave up. My sister was gonna buy me <laughs> McDonald's because it's my hat. It's an apology. But then as we were walking back home along the beach, we just found it. That one. As we're walking down the beach, we just found it. So it's just weird that we've been losing things. I literally thought that someone had picked it up and uh, we're not going to find it. But we found it. But yeah, we were at the beach today. It was nice. But then it got super windy, super cloudy real quick. So a lot of people are now going home because the weather's not giving, you know. I also couldn't record a lot of things because a lot of people were topless. Another cool thing about the beach is the fact that people can play sports. A lot of people play beach volley, which is just fun. So, like, um, usually when people go to the beach, if they're not, like, tanning or whatever, they're just playing volley. That's the W Hotel, the one that I was zooming on. It's, like, one of the famous hotels in Barcelona. Uh, this was on the same day. We're going to our last destination, Oh my god, this video is going so fast. But basically, this is Sagrada Familia. It's a church. It's a famous church. I really don't have any information. Any further information. But look at how big. How tall. And it's still under construction. It's been under construction for like, I don't know how many years. But people love this. We have some souvenirs that are related to Barcelona. But also the Sagrada Familia. Since like, it's very famous something that you could buy if you by any chance are connected to it or like really love it to that extent and yeah and then we have many sagrada familias here oh so this is the whole thing How do you feel about the fact that you're going back? I feel... I feel, you know... <laughs> let me talk to my language. <laughs> I feel really, really grateful. Nancy, I'm fine, actually. I'm kind of excited because my house is clean. Were you actually sad? Can we talk about that? Apparently, two days ago, she was feeling sad thinking about the fact it that she had to leave. Also, because I thought that day, on Monday, I thought the next day was Wednesday. So I was like, oh, it's just one day left. Hey guys, I'm probably in the same outfit that you saw me in seven days ago because my sister told me to bring one pair of clothing or maybe two. So she was like, just bring one outfit to travel with to and from. So that's why, yeah. And then, so basically, I was feeling sad, but like, it's because I thought Wednesday, okay, it's loud here, but I was feeling sad because I thought 
if this was on Monday when I was feeling sad because if, I thought Tuesday was Wednesday and like I was like oh so it's gonna be my last day or whatever and it didn't feel right and now it makes it so I was just a bit depressed but now I'm fine so my sister just left me so maybe let me just leave a cute message or whatever I actually don't have a cute message to leave I'll just uh, end here today I'm fine I'm kind of excited I'm still a bit sad but it's life I'll get over it in like two hours so yeah Bye. Make sure you subscribe. There she goes. Well, my sister is gone. Like, it really hit me when we got here at the airport. I didn't think I was going to feel sad. I was like, you know, I'm fine. I'm good. Whatever. But, like, I felt sad. But then, again, it's fine. I'm sure in by tomorrow I'll be good. I'll be like, Loki, we were starting to fight a lot. So, yeah, you know. Anyways, I'm sad. <laughs> I'm actually sad. But it's okay. Also, we came late. We came like, this girl is just taking his precious time, thinking she has time. Luckily, her flight got delayed. Like, her departure got delayed by an hour. And that's the only thing that saved her today. Otherwise, she was gonna miss that flight, I know for sure, because we were so late. And then the security check in just took long. And I was just standing there looking at her, and she was taking forever. So I'm kind of glad that the, the flight was delayed because I don't know, it would have been another story right now. Because who was gonna book for another flight? We literally, anyways, yeah. That was it for today's video. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Thank you. Make sure to subscribe. Comment down below what videos you want to see next. Comment down anything. Click that subscribe button. Click that bell button. And ciao. See you in the next video. Bye.